Good morning from Dubai. I just woke up to the most stunning view and sunrise. It is actually insane. This is what I get to see every single morning when I wake up. It's so pretty. The way that I've been craving this ever since I got it last night. I got this last night when I was hungry, but then I wasn't hungry anymore. So I was like, okay, I'll just save it for breakfast. This avocado sandwich looks so bomb. Mm. It's so good. I get it without mozzarella. Mm. Let's take a shower and I'll fill you guys in a little bit more because I think that's needed. I've made this my little makeup desk while we're here. So I have all of my skincare stuff and bits in here and I've made this my makeup drawer. And as you guys can see, it is really packed. Don't mind all of the mess. I was just um, filming some videos. Obviously I have a Sephora bag right here. So let's do our makeup. Clip this hair out of the way. Crazy lion's mane. I've actually purchased a lot of new makeup while I've been here because literally in every single mall that you go to there's a Sephora so I've kind of been going crazy with the makeup shopping I'm just gonna do some skincare because my skin feels so dry today I'm using this Tatcha cream that is literally one of my favorite skincare products ever I forgot to put on serum whatever I'm just gonna do moisturizer today this makes your skin super glowy. I used this product on my face yesterday before I started doing my makeup and I swear my makeup looked so good. This is the, it's actually a new product from Ilia. It's called the Base Face Milk. And it's kind of like, I don't know, like a moisturizing, priming milk or something. As most of you know, I haven't really been posting a lot on my YouTube channel and I do want to bring that back like i want to bring some change into that because i do really love youtube the only thing like why i've been gone is just because we have been so busy and youtube is like a lot of work so i try to mainly focus on my instagram and my tiktok and stuff which by the way if you guys are not following me on that you definitely should because that's where i post like every single day like everyday stuff but yeah, I do want to get back into vlogging my daily life a little bit more. So I'm actually starting that from today. And if you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen that we are in Dubai. And I've been getting loads of messages and DMs and questions from you guys asking me, like, what are you doing there? Have you moved? You haven't updated us. I'm in Dubai with Jelano, my boyfriend, who's laying right behind me in bed. And we decided to come here for a month. So the reason that we decided to come here is kind of like for a holiday and to just relax and also to get lots of work done. And me and Jelano also kind of want to start sampling some countries and just kind of see where we like it, where we don't like it, and if we maybe possibly want to move there in the future. Um, so we have been here for quite a while. It's been a little bit rocky since we've been here. I have been doing some TikTok vlogs and a lot of Instagram stories, but I feel like those kind of always portray um, like the positive side and always make it look 100% perfect while in reality it's not so in the first week everything was basically fine like I was super motivated to get a lot of work done and then on one day I believe it was like the I don't know the, the fourth or fifth day or something 
um, me and John decided to go to this Italian restaurant because it was supposed to be really good, like it had good reviews and it looked pretty bougie. So, you know, we were just enjoying our lives here and then we decided to go to this restaurant. The food was like really good, but like literally 30 minutes after, Giordano started feeling really, really bad. And immediately that's when I was like, okay, this is not good like he's not feeling good then we got home i was feeling fine but like that night i started feeling really really bad um so basically it turned out we got like some i don't know what it was but basically some sort of food poisoning or something like mild food poisoning like we weren't freaking like laying in bed like zombies but we were feeling bad to the point where we couldn't do anything and it was just like not fun basically and by the way in the time that we're here we have booked two airbnbs so we have uh so we had our first airbnb for the first two weeks and then another airbnb which we're in right now for the last two weeks and i'm also not gonna lie that airbnb wasn't my favorite like i much prefer this one and i'll tell you guys why but that one like for me it just wasn't the vibe and then it was finally time to move to this apartment um which like instantly made me happier because like i told you guys before i feel like the first one just wasn't it for me so that's why when we got to this one i was super super happy i'll also do uh, an apartment tour because this apartment is really pretty so i want to show you guys also i'm gonna do bronzer now and blush and highlighter i just got this palette it's so stunning like on the first day i was literally so happy i was telling Gilano, oh my god like i'm gonna thrive here i feel so good like i'm so happy that i'm here guys the next morning i wake up and i'm like planning to go out for uh lunch with a friend and stuff like meet new people do fun things and i get sick again i first thought that it wasn't like anything serious i was like oh i'm getting a cold like my throat feels a bit weird i feel like i don't know maybe just a, a, a little something you know so i go about my day and i meet up with my friend for lunch we go to the mall and i get to the mall and i honestly like all of a sudden i feel like a, a freaking truck hit me or something like i felt knocked down um and i felt like i was starting to get a fever like it went downhill so freaking fast so afterwards i went home and obviously i noticed okay this isn't some you know like small little cold whatever like i'm actually getting sick sick and i started getting annoyed because we were like oh my god i just started getting better now we're here and i'm getting sick again like and then when i'm kind of starting to feel a little bit better then Jelano gets sick obviously he gets it from me because we do things together and we're like together 24 7 so then he gets sick and now there's only a week left of not even a week i think it's like five days or something four. Four, oh my gosh four days left of us being in dubai <clears throat> i literally have the nastiest cough and it's so annoying because when i cough it's like so loud and i feel like i'm so annoying everywhere that we go because i <clears throat> i feel like i have to like like stop it and like put it away because it's so obnoxious ah! here's my baby it's henry if you guys follow me on instagram you know this is my child our child and i put a scrunchie on his neck this is basically his clothes like his shirt do you want to tell that story how you got it what how i got henry mm -hmm. oh yeah so I got Henry. This is such a fun story. I was shopping and I was out in Primark and I saw this little bit like bear hanging all by himself like the last one on this rack and he literally looked so sad that I had to get him and now he's adopted and he's our child and he's literally living his best life. So even now we're just trying to make the best of it. I mean, I I mean I feel better now. It's just annoying that I still have this cough and I just want to feel better and not feel like miserable but you know it is what it is that's what i've been telling myself angela with this whole trip but it's hard you know like, like when you're here you wanna but i've been telling us it is what it is supposed like maybe it's supposed to happen for a reason eye shadow liner 
doing eyeshadow liner because I literally cannot live without it anymore and look how good that looks. We're, um... <laughs> I'm getting ready because we are going to the Dubai mall which in my opinion is one of the most fun things to do here and everyone's probably gonna think I'm crazy by saying that because I mean that's just me like I love shopping I love it so much and you can shop here like you can literally get everything seeing your makeup in daylight is always so different than seeing it with like a filming light because oh my gosh my neck does not match my face so i'm gonna have to dra <laughs> drag the bronzer down my chest also i went a, a, a little bit too heavy with the blush what time is it actually it's 8 51 um because i want to get to the mall super super early because when you go to the mall like later it's not fun anymore because it's way too busy and you get so overstimulated well at least we do just laying out my outfit i think this is going to be my ootd i have this top from skims which is literally my favorite top ever it literally snatches you in and it's so pretty and then i have these jeans from h&m these are just some ripped jeans this is where I literally recorded everything in slow-mo, even the apartment tour, and I actually hated myself for it. Just got to the cafe, and I realized that I've literally been recording in slow-mo this entire time. Like, I filmed an apartment tour, like, everything. It's in slow-mo. <sighs> recollect myself, and now we continue in not non-slow-mo version. Yummy, iced tea. <laughs> Ooh, it's a little sour this is what john has ordered he got a mac and cheese and oatmeal and mac and cheese mac and cheese sorry grilled okay. cheese and according to him this is supposed to be the best oatmeal in the world it's i only got an iced tea because i had um my joe and the juice this morning the crunch the crunch Ooh. As I was saying before I recorded everything from today in slow-mo So we plan on going to the Dubai mall But Jelano didn't have uh, or hadn't had breakfast yet So we decided to come to this cafe It's called Seven Seeds It's right there um, It's really good I didn't get anything because I already had my Joe in the juice this morning I'm going to celebrate the lost footage with some water from the cafe i'm not sure why but they gave me i asked for a to go bottle <laughs> and i got like this glass <laughs> one liter or whatever we bottle. were like can we get some water like to go like we'll pay the bill and then get some water yeah. and we'll go and the guy comes up to us and he's like oh yeah here you go and i'm like oh what <laughs> okay uh so we have our glass water bottle here Cheers, to babe. go <laughs> With bopping champagne, bopping bottles of water. Thank you. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to pee after this. But I lost all motivation there for a second in the cafe. Oh, sorry. Cheers. Because I was like, no, my day's over. I recorded everything in slow motion. Also, the camera that I'm vlogging on right now is actually a present. Uh, from Jelano, he surprised me with it last night because I kept going on and on about how I wanted a new vlogging camera because the one that I had was actually the vlogging camera that I started my YouTube journey with like it's like 10 years old yeah like back <laughs> in 2016 so a new camera was needed like needed so he surprised me with it last night which is really really sweet so I'm testing it out right now and it looks really good I mean I haven't looked at the footage yet, but just like from seeing it there. I really like the camera. It looks really nice. So let me know what you think. We've been to pretty much all the big malls here. I mean, there's like so many malls. We haven't seen them all, but we've seen like the biggest ones, but this is like by far the craziest one. And if you really want to shop, like you can find everything you want here. It's actually insane. There's also, um, I mean, there's everything in this mall. They even have like an ice rink. I also have a cinema in here, which we've been to 
<laughs> don't fall like three times and the cinema is so amazing they even have these like super big like lounge chairs so for some reason i'm Gelano, not sure why but i keep thinking the name is selected yeah preserved. I'm <laughs> not sure why. keeps calling this store selected and he said oh we should go to selected i'm like babe it's called reserve but it's fine <laughs> but this is like zara kind of but like more i don't know like bougie classy i don't know we don't have this at home so i'm gonna uh, gonna take a look around found this really really nice basic long sleeve top i'm gonna find gelano now and see where he is there he is spotted in the wild my little shopaholic <laughs> What have you got? That's nice. Yeah. And some pants. Some fitting pants. Navy green. Navy green. Oh my gosh. Navy this, green. This green. All in green. <laughs> Navy is blue. Yeah, but this green, I thought it was gray. Maybe it's the lighting. Yeah, it's like grayish green. It's but that sweater is nice. Up. Honestly thought that was gonna find more in here, but I think we have to hit up Zara next I'm really on the hunt for like a cute. Um, I don't know. What's it called like a vest Bolero thingy found this little bolero thingy that I was looking for Jelano's demonstrating I'm it for you guys <laughs> He's falling asleep <laughs> Long day to go <laughs> But um, she's just checking to see if there's matching pants with it as well Obviously won't wear it with this outfit, but it's actually really really cute. We're heading up Victoria's Secret because your girl needs some new underwear. Alright, found some underwear. They have so many like cute things and gift sets and stuff. So much. Got some cute stuff from Victoria's Secret. And next door is Zara. So you already know that we have to hit up Zara. Zara fitting room is actually the most unflattering lighting ever, but on my way out, I found these uh, like straight pants. And I've been looking for a pair like these because I have one, but they're about to like, I don't know, they're not good quality. So they look kind of weird, but got two sizes and I'm going to try them on. Oh my gosh, I think I just found literally the most nice flattering pants ever this is size medium i was gonna do small because i mean it's a little big but i'm afraid it's gonna be too short and i'm really short already so i think it's gonna look weird if it's shorter but oh my gosh i'm definitely getting these everyone literally run to zara for these i don't know if you can see the tag but really cute and i think it'll go really nice with the little like jelly blazer that i just got Chilano has deserted me i don't blame him uh, i think he thought that was taking too long so he went somewhere else to go and sit down so i am walking to him i think Chilano is taking me karting because there's a cart oh my gosh look at this this is like the perfect activity for you yeah. you love this stuff it actually looks fun He's always making me do things out of my comfort zone, right? Yeah, we're just a tiny bit. Like. A tiny bit. We're gonna have to put on these suits. Thank you. I guess we're really doing this. Going karting. I'm actually really excited. This is so funny. <gasps> oh, little beast is little. That was a lot of fun. We just got done. Hold up, I'm, I don't want to leave all my stuff here. But I did think the... the lab it was like too small. Yeah, it was. I the, thought it was. The map, or do you say? Yeah, the map, the lab. I don't know. I thought it was gonna be bigger because there was lots of turns and you couldn't like fully like just drive. That was actually really fun. I wish I could bring you guys along, uh, but you weren't allowed to take your phones or cameras or anything like that. And I don't know what has happened to my hair. Are you hungry? I am so hungry. So I really hope that. We can get some lunch or something here, you know, just a little something. We have come to this restaurant called Crave for lunch. I got myself a vegan banana protein shake, homemade hummus, and it comes with some chips and celery. Um, and Chilano ordered mashed potatoes, and he also got a Shake Shack from next door. <laughs> I would say that that was 
a very successful shopping trip but honestly I'm way too tired I don't know what it is but the mall just tires me out so much and after I've seen like five shops I just want to go home and go to bed or something I feel like that's with everything <laughs> we do air because we do stuff and then it's fun and then we come back and we are so <sighs> exhausted and everything like, yeah oh. it's it's fun but it's draining but anyway we did get uh, some stuff I'll do a haul oh and my batteries about to die but I'll do a haul once we get home and do that apartment tour. We're currently sat in the car park and we are booking and buying another suitcase because we're bringing way too much stuff back home because obviously all the shopping trips <laughs> need to come home with us. So we're home and I want to show you guys our apartment, the place that we've been staying at for the past two weeks. So let's do a little apartment tour. Got to start at the beginning, obviously. Also, before I start this, I just want to say, please do not mind the mess. Um, we've been living here for two weeks. It's a one bedroom. We literally have nowhere to put our stuff or suitcases or trash. So it's literally just all piled up randomly throughout the apartment but anyway you walk in this is the hallway <sighs> lots of mess and trash right here but you walk this way and then right here you have a really big stunning mirror here's where we keep our shoes and keys and stuff like that um this is gelano's suitcase and then and here we have oops and then and here we have the laundry room it smells really bad in there not because of us like it literally <laughs> smelled bad as soon as we got here and then this is the stunning view that we get to see every single day and you do actually see a uh, sunset and sunrise here which is so beautiful but this is just a little living area couch right there again we don't have any space to store our stuff um, some seating stuff right here, but we literally never sit uh, at that table. And then a little kitchen. Also, we have not used the kitchen once. Like, literally only made the, uh, used the kitchen to make tea or something. Um, because we've just been ordering food. Like, I'm not over-exaggerating. There's literally nothing in the fridge. Then, this way is our bedroom. Lovely. I made the bed, but it's all gone wrinkly and it's very annoying to me uh, and then this is my little makeup nook so it's messy but it's a pretty mess you know what i mean like it is full of shit but it still looks really really pretty so this is just where i've been getting ready every single day i stored all of my makeup in here uh for the time being and this one has like some skincare bits and stuff like that closet right there that is super full with all of our stuff and then you can access the balcony either via the bedroom or the living room which is right there so let's just open this door up so you guys can see the view see the race results the race results yeah. of our carts yeah our mario karting so I was obviously first, you were Ooh, last, I'm sorry. Oh, that was the other girl on the yeah. track. And I was actually fourth of the entire day. <gasps> because, yeah. Wow, you're a even, winner. I wasn't even trying that hard. Yeah, but you were fast, bro. Yeah. That girl that was on the track with us, she was literally 12 years old and she was beating me. <laughs> so also this is the stuff that we got today. So I'm just going to do a little haul and show you guys everything that I got cuz I really love all the stuff that I got. So let's go into the bedroom. I found some really cute bits today. Um it is actually the Sunday of Black Friday weekend, so a lot of stores had like a lot of sales going on. So I first went into Mango and I told you guys I was looking for like a little blazer Gillette thing like I don't know what this is called, but I found one uh, This is from mango and I really want to wear it with some like Classy pants like a cute little top for more of like a classy outfit. So this was actually on sale um, It was originally 300 dirhams and I got it for 
150 which is literally 50% off so that's a steal I love it and it's such good quality too uh, but yeah then I went to Zara and at first I didn't find anything I was walking out of the store and then something caught my eye and I saw these really beautiful pants so I've been needing a pair of dressy pants like this and I showed you guys in the uh, fitting rooms that it fit really really nice so this is literally just the most basic thing ever then i went into victoria's secret and they had uh buy one get one free so i got two pairs of underwear just really cute basic like underwear gray and green i was really like debating uh whether to buy some pjs or not but like i always just think pjs are such a waste of money but then again they're not because like you want to look cute even when you go to bed but i just i don't know i just couldn't because I always just think stuff like that's unnecessary. And now I kind of wish that I had gotten them, but it's fine. I'm doing some small touch-ups on my makeup. And I also just put my hair in like a little half up, like slick back. Because it's been annoying me all day. Like, I don't know what it is. You guys know, sometimes you just have annoying hair days. Um, so just touching on makeup right now really really need some lip oil i'm out of this one i've been using it for a month like every single day and it's now running out i also put on something a little bit more comfortable i switched out my jeans um for these jogging like trousers from zara they're super comfortable because me and jelano are gonna go to top golf let's get this Thing off i want to share my new favorite product with you this perfume is you know with the smell of sunscreen if you love the smell of sunscreen you're gonna love this perfume because it's literally sunscreen summer smell in a bottle it's from sol de janeiro and i got it at sephora when i first got here you ready to go to top go kind of ready you want to tell them about what happened or no <laughs> Jelano's a little annoyed because he was going on a run today at 4.30. Oh, no, no. He was going on a run today at 4.30 p.m. Or so he thought. <laughs> it was actually 4.30 a.m. this morning when like he that's was... that's how far I am in my head. <laughs> when he was sound asleep. It was the biggest run in Dubai of the year. Like the it biggest run like ever. The main road in front of the f Museum of the Future. And I barely missed it. Like You're kind of bummed that you didn't make it. But it's fine. I actually, like we... Yeah. Listen. Like, like we've been telling ourselves this whole trip supposed to happen everything happens for a reason i guess <laughs> we're kind of tired of saying that now after all the, <laughs> after all the shit that's been happening to us this month this is the lift lobby <laughs> master has given dobby <laughs> a sock <laughs> guys tell me that i'm not good you're dobby i'm dobby <laughs> 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 not me, not him, I me, you. They're blasting Nicki Minaj at the entrance. The sunset's so pretty, it's all like light purple. Just got to our little booth. Jelan was setting everything up. This is my first time, so I literally have no idea how it works. So, the ball for this game I put for you. The ball Look at that right there, Georgina. I have a feeling Jelano is gonna Jelano is gonna win. I hope so. It's gonna be the final one, guys. It's gonna be so exciting. Ah. Ah. Nah. Okay, that was it. I won. No. Nah. I'm the loser. No. Baby, you won. He did great. 
your one. <laughs> I cheated, actually. No, you didn't. On our way to um, a restaurant because we were both super hungry. It's called Firuze. Firuze. I'm gonna give them a free shout out, and you don't even know. So it's good. <laughs> okay, so this is not a shout out because I don't know if the food's good yet, so stay tuned for that. But it's an Iranian restaurant, but I'm actually really curious because it has 4.8 stars, which is crazy. Like a restaurant never has that high of a rating. So, uh, I think we took the the wrong. No. I think we're good. Oh. It's only four minutes away. We're just walking along the marina so to the busy. restaurant. It's really busy, but it's it looks so beautiful. Oh You're hungry? It looks really nice. So it's my meal is really, really good and I'm so hungry. Thoughts on the food? Yeah, it was uh, delicious. <laughs> yeah, it was really nice actually. I had high hopes because of the high ratings, but it delivered. We are so done with today. We did a lot of stuff today and I'm actually exhausted. I just took a shower. I still need to do my skincare and I have so much mascara underneath my eyes. I look crazy. I'm so excited.